everyone. I am, uh, my name is Anastasia and I am a traveler. I traveled for seven years and also I am a writer. I published one book and there are some more books that I am editing right now. And today I will tell you uh, seven, uh, seven uh, very good stories about my travelings. Uh, it's like a special stories that happened uh, in my life. Of course, it was more than seven because I travel many years and four years I live in travelings. So I live in different countries and I don't come back home for a long time. The first story is uh, happened with me in Sihate Alin uh, Nature Resort. I lived there as a, a volunteer, journalist volunteer. And um, one day I traveled uh, to the beach and I saw their seals, uh, wild seals, and they uh, lied uh, on rocks. Uh, and so I want to see them uh, more close. So very slow hide uh, behind the rocks. I start to um, go uh, close. And they, of course, they saw me. Uh, and But they was uh, more curious than scary. And so they just watched me. I decide to swim with them. So I get inside the cold water and it was windy day. So it was a little bit cold and there was slippery rock. <laughs> but after I came uh, very close to them, uh, they start to uh, get from rocks into the water and circle around around me. And and that that time I understood that it is a little bit dangerous. Uh, uh, and uh, I was a little bit scary on that time. But after I saw the huge muzzles and how they do how they do like like this when they come uh, f from the water and it was so cute that I understood that uh, everything is perfect and I wanted to reach out my hand and touch them. Amazing story from my traveling happened with me in Malaysia and um, there was a family we meet just on the street. I was with backpack and I uh, wrote on the paper that I am a traveler and I would like to meet with people so you can talk to, uh, they can talk to me and uh, they saw me they come to talk to me and there was a very good family they had uh, five four kids and I uh, become uh, his fifth kid and they took me to visit his uh, their relatives in uh, different cities so I traveled with them uh, through the whole Malaysia and um, we rode bicycles together we cook chokkado and different and other uh, different dishes and also we uh, played Sipata Crow and it was uh, kind of my dream. I wanted to try Sipata Crow. I am a volleyball player. I'm semi-professional volleyball player and uh, Sipata Crow it's a uh, half uh, volleyball, half football. So you play uh, like a volleyball with volleyball rules but with legs and that's amazing for me. Uh, and when I played Sipata Crow I was so happy and uh, it was so nice to become uh, <laughs> to become a child in this family and now we still keep in touch and we send each other letters uh, hand uh, writing letters. I traveled by hitchhiking in Myanmar uh, on Tinjan holiday. Um, they, it, it is a holiday that everyone uh, throughout a week uh, the week uh, pour the water into each other uh, to wash away their sins. Uh, uh, it's uh, it's uh, their like a New Year holiday, and so they take uh, everything and they put uh, from the houses. And uh, when people um, drive uh, on the streets, they just uh, pour water on them. Uh, and uh, everyone have a lot of fun and everyone um, stop the cars and give some presents, some local food and uh, say good words and uh, they all dance, sing and it was so amazing. I slept in tent uh, on the cave in Cappadocia. Uh, it was uh, somewhere on the top of the rock, that cave, and the view was so amazing from there. I still remember uh, when I sit there 
uh, and just look outside and there is stars, uh, there is a beautiful valley with lots of uh, hills and mountains and uh, that was so amazing uh, sunset. Uh, so that's, uh, that moment is still in my heart. And I uh, was hiking on Lysian Way uh, on uh, June and uh, I uh, saw lots of sea turtles. You know, like before I haven't seen one, but on that time I saw many, like like thousands, not even hundreds, and uh, they all swarm uh, near the coast and you can see their uh, muzzles uh, in the waves, you know, like the wave is coming and you can see there like in the mirror uh, how they swim and it's so amazing view, you know, and also in the night I can see how they crawl it out uh, onto the sand on air space exhibition in Zhuhai and I was uh, I was a journalist and I should took some photos and I should take some took some interviews uh, with the uh, people and uh, the exhibition is really amazing like not many people can go there you can see fights you can see uh, tanks uh, and also in my traveling I met people who uh, do acrobalance and I learned how to do acrobalance and I love that and now I'm also doing this and uh, enjoying and so see the video how, how it is Bye bye and see you next videos. <laughs>